Sambucus, Wikipedia Audio See text Sambucus is a genus of flowering plants in the family Adoxaceae. The various species are commonly called elder or elderberry. The genus was formerly placed in the honeysuckle family, Caprifoliaceae, but was reclassified as Adoxaceae due to genetic and morphological comparisons to plants in the genus Adaza. The oppositely arranged leaves are pinnate with five nine leaflets. Each leaf is 530 cm long, and the leaflets have serrated margins. They bear large clusters of small white or cream-colored flowers in late spring, these are followed by clusters of small black, blue-black, or red berries. Description The genus occurs in temperate to subtropical regions of the world. More widespread in the northern hemisphere, its southern hemisphere occurrence is restricted to parts of Australasia and South America. Many species are widely cultivated for their ornamental leaves, flowers, and fruit. Species recognized in this genus are Ornamental varieties of Sambucus are grown in gardens for their showy flowers, fruits, and lacy foliage. Native species of elderberry are often planted by people wishing to support native butterfly and bird species. Elderberry fruit or flowers are used as dietary supplements for minor diseases such as flu, colds, constipation, and other conditions, often served as a tea, extract, or in a capsule. There is insufficient research to know its effectiveness for such uses or its safety profile. Raw elderberries are 80% water, 18% carbohydrates, and less than 1% each of protein and fat. In a 100 gram amount, elderberries supply 73 calories and are a rich source of vitamin C, providing 43% of the daily value. Elderberries also have moderate contents of vitamin B6 and iron, with no other nutrients in significant content. The French, Austrians and Central Europeans produce elderflower syrup, commonly made from an extract of elderflower blossoms, which is added to palet skink and filling instead of blueberries. People throughout much of Central, Eastern and Southeastern Europe use a similar method to make a syrup which is diluted with water and used as a drink or as a flavoring in several food products. Fruit pies and relishes are produced with berries. Romanians produce a traditional soft drink in May and June called soke or suc de soc. It is produced by letting the flowers macerate with water, yeast, and lemon for 2-3 days. The last stage of fermentation is done in a closed pressure-proof bottle to produce a fizzy drink. The beverage has also inspired Coca-Cola to launch an elderflower-based drink, Fanta Shokata. The flowers of Sambucus nigra are used to produce elderflower cordial. Germain, an American liqueur with faux French branding, is made from elderflowers. Halland's Flatter, a Swedish aquavit, is flavored with elderflowers. Despite the similarity in name, the Italian liqueur Sambuca is mostly made with star anise and fennel essential oils extracted by vapor distillation. It also contains elderflower extracts with which it is flavored to add a floral note, to smooth and round off the strong licorice flavor. Hollowed elderberry twigs have traditionally been used as spiles to tap maple trees for syrup. Although the ripe, cooked berries of most species of Sambucus are edible, uncooked berries and other parts of plants from this genus are poisonous. The leaves, twigs, branches, seeds, and roots of Sambucus plants can contain a cyanidin glycoside. Ingesting a sufficient quantity of cyanidin glycosides may produce illnesses. Distribution and Habitat in 1984, 
a group of 25 people were made sick, apparently by elderberry juice pressed from fresh, uncooked Sambucus mexicana berries, leaves, and stems. However, all 25 recovered quickly, including one individual who was hospitalized after drinking five glasses. Although practitioners of traditional medicine have used black elderberry for hundreds of years, including as wine intended for treating rheumatism and pain from traumatic injury, there is no scientific evidence that such practices have any beneficial effect. Additionally, black elderberry has been utilized as a treatment for flu symptoms. While some preliminary research indicates that elderberry may relieve flu symptoms, the evidence is not strong enough to support its use for this purpose. In Northern California, elderberries are a food for migrating band-tailed pigeons. Elders are used as food plants by the larvae of some Lepidoptera species including brown tail, buff ermine, dot moth, emperor moth, and grailed moth, swallow-tailed moth and the v-pug. The crushed foliage and immature fruit have a strong fetid smell. Valley elderberry longhorn beetles in California are very often found around red or blue elderberry bushes. Females lay their eggs on the bark. The pith of elder has been used by watchmakers for cleaning tools before intricate work. Elder commonly grows near farms and homesteads. It is a nitrogen-dependent plant and thus is generally found near places of organic waste disposal. Elders are often grown as a hedgerow plant in Britain since they take very fast, can be bent into shape easily and grow quite profusely, thus having gained the reputation of being an instant hedge. It is not generally affected by soil type or pH level and will virtually grow anywhere sufficient sunlight is available. Folklore related to elder trees is extensive and can vary according to region. In some myths, the elder tree is thought to ward off evil and give protection from witches, while other beliefs say that witches often congregate under the plant, especially when it is full of fruit. If an elder tree was cut down, a spirit known as the elder mother would be released and take her revenge. The tree could only safely be cut while chanting a rhyme to the elder mother. Made from the branch of an elder tree, the Elder Wand plays a pivotal role in the final book of the Harry Potter series, which was nearly named Harry Potter and the Elder Wand before author J.K. Rowling decided on Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. This article incorporates text from a publication now in the public domain, National Institutes of Health's National Center for Complementary and Integrative Health Entry for European Elder. Taxonomy. Cultivation. Uses. Nutrition. Food. Potential toxicity. Traditional medicine. Ecology. Habitat. Folklore and fiction.